This is Sulina at 10 to 6 in the morning, Sunday morning, 17th of May. And from Sulina, which is about 7 kilometers from Oak Virginia's, I'm now going to drive to Scavina, which is just to the west of Krakow. Unfortunately the weather is a bit foggy, so it will reduce visibility, which is a pity because it's such a nice day. Here, once again, I hear the wonderful sounds of the birds. And I think it will be a very nice day later. Yesterday it rained a bit. Not a bit, it rained a lot, which rather spoilt the uh, pre-election meeting I was at. I love to be out in the countryside. So that's goodbye to Solina. Don't suppose I'll be here ever again. My friend is leaving at the end of next month. And it's not the sort of place <clears throat> I'm likely to come back to again, which is a pity. Well, this is Kielkovice. It's in the local authority of um, Oak Virginia's. Now the question is, can I remember the route or not? Amcha. Um, now the, it's normally a very nice view of the, uh, the castle at Old Virginia's from here. But uh, I've got a feeling there won't be such a good view today. There's fog lights on. I haven't. I don't think it's bad enough yet. Castle, the Dog Virginians is on the left. <coughs> but it's totally invisible. Pleasant. Pity. Mm, 
there it's up there from Boston didn't see it <coughs> at all fortunately I do have other films with uh, of Virginia Tin Here on the right, not only is the photo radar, photo radar, whatever it's called, and the thing to tell you to slow down, but there's a hotel called Charnicott which I stayed in last time. And that's the speed camera. Oh, Charney PS it's called, sorry, you got it wrong. The Black Dog. And there's somebody in front of me who's not too bothered about the photo radar, a speed camera I should say. And um because I'm going just a couple of kilometers now we're over the limit. And then again in the fog maybe they don't see. Here I turn left. The fog doesn't show any sign of letting up. Oh, well, this is Malopolsky, the um, province. So just gone over the border. The previous village, about uh, four or five kilometers back, was called Orodaki. Um, and this village isn't so interesting, it's all new. Ish. Oops. just won't lift, which is a pity because this is the, it's just, the, it's very, very attractive, and uh, just can't see anything, quarter to seven in the morning. Well, if this were night, I wouldn't be driving the car. Um, visibility is what, 30 meters? It's that. And um, I've got my fog lamps on in the front. First time I can recall doing that during the day. And the point of that, of course, is not so I can see. Fog lamps at the front are obviously directed so that the driver can see, and so that other people see me. Uh, this is Alkush, and this is the road to Krakow. There's two roads from Krak from Katowice to Krakow, and this is one of them. And this is the northern road. And so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to stay on this road, then I go to head off in the direction of a place called Zabierov um, the exit from which may be uh, well I'll find it of course but it's going to be rather hidden in this it's a pity again once again because the road goes down and goes up again it's very nice views and then uh, from there I'll head on to the ring road I think it is uh, from Krakow and then yes I'll head on to the ring road and then I'll be on to uh, go to Skavina and that should take me about an hour and a half view of the weather situation.